This is a video about, you guessed it, crickets. One of the many feeder insects that people in the invertebrates and reptile world uh, feed to their pets. I'm sure that there's some controversy, um, even within myself. Um, I'm actually a vegetarian, so it's difficult for me to feed the crickets to the tarantulas. But I look at it like this. The tarantulas need to eat. The crickets in my care are going to live a good life. I'm gonna make sure of that. Um, and it is the cycle of life. So uh, moving forward, I want to talk to you about raising crickets and keeping them happy. Um, here you see some of my large crickets and they are enjoying their home. Um, here are some babies and there's two little babies in here, little fat ones. And these guys came by, uh, came to be sort of haphazardly. Um, they actually showed up in my exoterra because a large female cricket laid eggs in there. I actually saw her do that. So I have these eggs and they came from a little cup that I placed inside of my crickets critter keeper and the pregnant females laid their eggs down underneath the moss and here you see the eggs and you see all of the little baby crickets running around and mind you they're tiny they're tiny they're like a pinhead and I did not even know that these eggs were gonna hatch I almost gave up on them but, lo and behold, now I'm raising crickets. So the first question I have uh, to answer here is what do I feed them? Well, right now I am giving them this Fluker's High Calcium Cricket Diet. I'm giving them the Cricket Quencher in place of water. But I actually like giving them water, I think, maybe better. Here you see that's a female cricket. Um, and they're enjoying some lettuce. Here are some more um, crickets. They're on an egg crate. You can usually get egg crates for free. Uh, just ask your friends and family to save them for you. Just tear them in half. I use paper towels on the bottom. Um, make sure that they have a little bit of variety. They seem to really love lettuce. Mine don't really take to carrots and they don't seem to really enjoy apples very much either. But you know something they really love that I happen to have on hand are hemp seeds. I also add nutritional yeast to their food. And surprisingly, my crickets don't really smell. You just have to make sure to clean up, you know, if there are any that pass away, um, you know, clean those up and just prepare a new paper towel every time you get new crickets. Let's take a look at these babies again. There's the eggs. You can check through the substrate, you'll be able to see the eggs. And here's a little bowl of food that I'm gonna put inside the uh, container I have the babies in. So here they are. You've got their moss. I sprayed the corner so that they won't drown. And they're all over the place. Just gotta keep them at a good temperature. It's about 77, 78 degrees here. Uh, this is the am ambient temperature here at my house. So I'm waiting for them to grow. They, uh, have a, uh, a good lid on top. So these are some of the supplies that I used. This is a, a little container I had a couple crickets in when I first found them and some cloth so that the females can lay their eggs. And here's one of the little bowls that I'm using inside of, of the Critter Keeper. It's filled with cocoa fiber substrate. It's very moist, almost wet. And I place that piece of cloth on there and put a, a rubber band around it. 
Right now they're drinking. And there's both males and females in here. See now here's a female, she's walking over to the left and you see how she has that long um, black, looks like a stinger, but that's actually what she uses to deposit eggs. And there's, there's a male on the right there, in fact all of those over on the right are males, they do not have have the uh, long uh, black egg depositor. <laughs> I don't know what it's called. I'm gonna find out though. So to lay eggs a female would would take that long black um, appendage and she would insert it through this cloth down into the dirt and lay her eggs. And I use the cloth now because sometimes they eat the eggs. So thank you for watching. <laughs>